Well, the day after a Browns loss, 43-13 to the Titans in their opener, and the talk continues today to be about the Browns' issues with penalties, especially the personal foul penalties. You know, Miles Garrett hitting Delaney Walker in the face, uh, Greg Robinson kicking Kenny Vaccaro in the head. Mary Kay, we heard from Freddie Kitchens today. We also heard from Robinson as well about the Browns and their lack of discipline. Yeah, Greg Robinson acknowledges that he hurt the team and he plans to apologize, maybe not all at once, but he's trying to get around and say that he's really sorry for what happened. He doesn't want to let that happen again. He did say that it wasn't intentional, that he did not try uh, to kick Kenny Vaccaro in the head. Of course, he'll probably be fined for that. He's not going to be suspended, uh, and I'm sure he will try to appeal the fine. Well, they say that the uh, the tape doesn't lie. I'll believe that maybe he didn't try to kick him in the head, but it sure looked like he did try to deliver some kind of blow with his foot there um, on some part of Vaccaro's body. So, Scott, uh, obviously the discipline continues to be an issue. Um, it's something they're going to have to fix before Monday night. Yeah, and I think if it was just Miles Garrett, if it was just uh, Greg Robinson or even Deborah Lawrence, it would be it would be some different, some uh, you know more sent towards one person but you had everything happening they had just they ran the gamut of penalties and when you see all that on the sideline and when you see what it cost them I think that's maybe the positive coming out of this that everybody got to see it everybody got to see what happened it was so many people and now they know that you, you can't do it anymore because it's up to the players individually I'll tell you one guy that has certainly has been paying attention to it and that's the Browns former defensive coordinator Greg Williams that's who they face on Monday night and uh, Mary Kay that's probably going to be a guy who's going to sort of like Mike Rabel a little bit who's going to understand get these guys to respond and maybe you can get some free yardage. Well you know I wouldn't be surprised I'm sure that Greg is going to pull out all the stops now he saw that they were undisciplined in this game and I'm sure he's going to try to maybe have his guys bait them into something he knows that there are some very emotional players on this team so that is going to have to be a point of emphasis for the Cleveland Browns this week they have to keep their wits about them. All right, so the Browns take on the Jets Monday night preparations start uh, here this week. And, of course, we will cover it all at cleveland.com slash Browns and on Football Insider. Just click that blue bar on the top of cleveland.com slash Browns to get texts, a daily newsletter with a little uh, thing that doesn't show up on the site, $3.99 a month. Check it out.